So, this is a Geiger counter. This is the device we will be using to detect radiation in our experiments. And the way it works, it has a little tube here in the back. And inside that tube are two electrodes. And when radiation passes in that tube, it ionizes the gas inside, which allows a current to pass through those two electrodes, giving the device a reading. Currently, it is on graphical mode. To test that it works, we're going to be using 2% thorium tungsten welding electrodes. Uh, if I'm not mistaken, these are used for TIG welding, and I have 10 pieces here. Uh, going to use these in a later experiment as well to use so, uh, hydrogen peroxide in order to melt away that tungsten and to get pure thorium metal. So we'll measure out all these electrodes and we'll figure out how much thorium we can get by weight if we do it properly. So our Geiger counter has just been sitting on the table here and we can see that the background radiation hopefully you can focus this is 19 so like 16 to 19 counts per minute on average uh, we'll keep it on graphical mode just so it's easier to show on camera even just approaching the thorium electrodes it seems to have more activity Now you can obviously hear there's more activity there. And we'll just let that sit. So I've switched over the display setting from graphical to the large font display setting. And just placing it on there, it seems to have stabilized at around between 100 and 110, generally. Seems to be going down now. Uh, thorium should have mostly alpha particle emissions. So that's all for today's quick demo. Stay tuned if you want to see the experiment where we're going to be extracting thorium metal from the welding electrodes.